Welcome to Postface Performance. I'm Daniel. Today we're back in the engine dyno room. Uh, have a 2JZ, what was originally a GE VGTI engine. Um, today we're testing some products from Dodo Racing. We have a Dodo Racing turbo manifold and Dodo Racing ignition coil kit. So for a long time we've used the uh, Audi kind of R8 style coils and that's a kit that you can buy from us on postace.ca. But on the, particularly on the GE valve covers, then they're not a good fit, they're, they're a bit tall. So we're excited to see how these Dodo coils uh, test out. And today we're gonna put them through their paces and, and see where they go. Hopefully we can insert some pictures of them up here so you can see the difference. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. Okay, so we're just about to start some testing. We're gonna start down at waste gate, which I believe is gonna be about 14 PSI. And we'll kind of up from there, see where we get to. As you can see, we've already done a couple of runs. This is the Dodo Cast T4 manifold. Uh, we're using a local Performance World wastegate, and this is a Borg Werner 366, I believe. Uh, the packaging is really neat, really nice. Obviously, I don't have to worry about wastegate position in here, so we just send it, but uh, I think this will work in a lot of setups. Okay, so we've just put the Jay-Z through its paces. We did some testing with initially the R8 coils, as I said before, I've used those a lot, never given me problems, and they work great. Dodo coils swapped straight in. Uh, I've seen no power difference between them, which is kind of what we expect. Either a coil will, will perform or it will not. Uh, uh, and we've run up to 27, 28 pounds of boost uh, with absolutely no spark bar. I think gap wise I'm running about 030 on the spark plugs right now. Uh, so coils have worked good, uh, no complaints there at all. Again with the exhaust manifold, I've not done any comparison testing on this particular video, but uh, power is where we expect to be. In fact, behind me we can see uh, on a run of about 26 PSI, we've done 690 horsepower and 605 torque. So right now we are just using a, a manual boost controller, so no, no great control. Uh, so we'd just like to wrap this up by saying thank you very much to Dodo Racing. Uh, I really enjoy testing products out. Uh, the Engine Dyno is a great platform for that. As far as getting your hands on Dodo Racing products, I believe the full catalog is available locally. Uh, Fish Racing Tech, so hop on the Fish Racing Tech website and I believe all of the Dodo products are available there. The coils are, I have a pre-production set right now. I think they are coming in the next few weeks if I'm, if I believe right. So keep an eye on them, they'll be out and maybe we'll have them as well. So.